Hi guys, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Rook. This is gonna be a week of my life. I'm starting the week off on a very positive note. I don't know, I just feel really good. Like I had a really good weekend and I just feel really recharged for the first time in like a while. I didn't just like sit on my couch and like do work stuff all weekend. I actually like let myself go and like I wasn't vlogging and I just like disconnected and it was like really nice. I obviously love doing this. Like if you guys don't know, I'm 23. This is my full-time job and I have a podcast called Gals on the Go podcast with my friend Danielle. And I'm so beyond like lucky that this is my life and everything. But I think taking just some breaks and not vlogging every single day, it makes it so much more special when I do vlog. This week, we're getting back after it. blowing out my candles right now because it is the middle of the day on a Monday and I'm gonna go work out. I've just been still doing cardio. It's been really enjoyable. I watch a show recently. I've been watching All American. I bring my iPad down. I connect my AirPods and I just do that for 30 minutes. And then I just walk on an incline for a little bit and it really works for me. I've been doing it now for probably like two to three months. Oh my gosh, almost three because I started like beginning of the year. We're almost at March, which is really freaky. Feeling really good. That's really the update for right now. It's a big cleaning day in my apartment. I'm like doing my sheets and everything right now but um i'm wearing my hangovers hoodie hangover hoodie it's not plural some lines from little lemon and some sneakers so very basic let's go i don't want to say get it over with because i actually like enjoy it but if i get it over with now it's good because then at four o'clock i have therapy i really like actually working out before i have therapy because i don't know like after therapy i'm so exhausted like i'm mentally drained like usually i cry like i don't know it's just a lot so getting it over with first really works for me. I don't know what we're gonna do for dinner and stuff. I think Hellfresh is coming this week. So that's always exciting. Hook up some fun meals. Okay, bye. I just didn't vlog yesterday. It was just one of those days. Good morning. It is 7.57 a.m. on Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, guys. I have a large bag of stuff back here. I'm gonna ship to Mariah. I love to send my friends some of my PR stuff. I love to like give it to family and friends and I wanna get that done, but I don't know what time the FedEx store opens. I woke up extra early today, but I went to bed pretty early. It actually does open at 8 a.m. So I'll get there a little bit after opening. I'm gonna bring that over, ship that stuff to her. I just have it in a bag. I have them like pack it and ship it, but it's like this large um, Ertzia bag. Rest of the day, we're recording for Gals on the Go at like two. Oh, I think I'm getting dinner with Emma and our friend Teal, who actually, this is so crazy, you guys. So Teal is one of Emma's clients now. Emma does our graphic design work for Gals on the Go, but she's also become like one of my really good friends. But Teal is one of her clients and Teal also used to be my camp counselor. If you guys don't know, I went to a sleepaway theater camp for three years and Teal was my favorite counselor. And now we're all connected again, which is just so cool. It's crazy how life works that way. So I think we're all gonna get dinner later. Oh, I have a call at four. It's basically just another like work day, you know? Let's go uh, to FedEx. Maybe I'll treat myself to a Dunkin' because that's nearby too. The Dunkin' sweet cream cold foam or whatever comes out tomorrow. But I just um, came to the understanding that they are literally using essentially whipped cream like they're just spraying it on top I'll have to try it and let you guys know but that's concerning to me you know Starbucks you go and they like make whatever sweet cream or cold foam or whatever you're getting they don't even have the capabilities to make it I'm so confused that location wasn't open at 8 a.m. and I just wanted to keep walking so we're gonna go to the UPS store instead. I'm hoping that this one's open. <laughs> All right, that was a massive success. I literally just dropped it off, paid. Getting my morning steps in, honestly. Making soup for lunch, not making, heating up really. It's from Whole Foods and I just haven't had it, so yum. All right, I'm about to Uber. I'll show you guys my fit. I think the top and the bottoms are from Princess Polly. Uh, well, I know the bottoms are. Wearing my boots. I can't stop wearing them. This is just like a, bla a blasic. I was about to say blasic, but also black at the same time. A basic black tank. And then I'm going to wear my leather jacket. Every time I say basics, I think of, I do headspace now. And they say like, welcome back to basics. He does it in his like Australian accent. No one like can relate to that. I'm all over the place. But yeah, let's go to dinner. I am so beyond excited. I've never been there. I feel so bougie, you guys. Don't mind me. <laughs> I'm so fucking annoying. Okay, bye. Hey guys, good morning. I hear someone in my hallway, so I can't really scream right now. I hope you guys are all doing well. I just vacuumed and then I caught myself. I mean, it's still 
good to vacuum. My hair goes everywhere. I don't know if anybody else could relate to this. It's all in the living room. It's all in the kitchen. My hair just goes everywhere. I don't even know how it's possible that I'm losing so much hair every day. It's, it's always been like this. My hair is like pretty thick, so it's all good. I'm just confused. Tomorrow, I'm having someone come and clean my apartment. I've never done that. My house at home, we've used a cleaning service, if you will, but I've never personally paid for it. But I do want to film my apartment tour and I want to make sure that everything is like sparkling and like really like just a deep clean. I do a good job of like keeping up, I think, with the tidiness of my space. I really do like it to be tidy. I don't like stuff to just be like out. I think I need a good like scrub of everything, you know what I mean? So getting that done tomorrow. So I'll have to go somewhere. I think I'm gonna get my nails done in the meanwhile tomorrow. I'm thinking about tomorrow. Let's think about today. I'm gonna make a coffee. Honestly, gotta get a lot of work done today because I'm just letting it pile up, which is not so good. My Amazon glasses, these are my favorite on Gals on the Go this week. New episode of Gals on the Go just went up. Let's make our coffee. The red bottle of the cold brew, so good. Pour that in. That's a lot, but you know. I need to go get like almond milk and stuff like that, but I do have this creamer, which I really like. Italian sweet cream. That was kind of a lot, but I bought it. Also linked on my Amazon shop. I don't care that it's past Valentine's Day and I'm still using these. That I didn't even get them for Valentine's Day. These are my heart-shaped ice cubes. So this morning, I'm gonna get ready because I do need to take some content for a brand or even two possibly. I'm waiting on some stuff to get delivered, um, some outfits. I wanna take some outfit pictures, but clothes aren't here, so that's impossible. I feel like I'm kind of having an off week, not in a bad way, like nothing's pressing and like happening in my life to like be prompting me to have an off week, but I just feel like I'm not, I'm not in the right mindset. Like I feel like, I don't know, even yesterday, I feel like it was like, oh wait, it's already six o'clock. I'm feeling deaf. We'll figure it out. We'll drink our coffee. We'll get ready. I have to organize some of this stuff back here. I just got these sent to me, which I'm kind of excited to try. These Artiste face brushes. I've heard so much about them. They're pretty expensive, I think. They're pretty bougie. And then what's this? A brush cleaning pad and a brush cleansing foam. So I'll definitely try these out for you guys. Always down to try new things. You know me. So I guess you like put your foundation on with them and you like rub them on your face. I can link them down below. They're very, very soft. I will say that. I usually just use a beauty blender, but I just like slap makeup on my face. I feel like these are like really like premium. Wow. Look at these ones. This one's like a little guy. Is that like for concealer? I need to read up on these two. Just like touching it all on my face. Love that. I'm gonna go drink my coffee now. <laughs> Put on a little outfit, got a little ready, and I just went downstairs and picked up this package from Nude Beverages. They sent me two cases of their seltzer. I already put one in my fridge. I'm doing some light organization. I feel like I have so many beverages, you guys. Very thankful, but I have a lot of like seltzers and things, but these are alcoholic, which I think is really cool. Very good. It's a beautiful day, you guys. Um, I stepped outside for a little bit. I have some time right now. I have to go pick up my prescription, which is just my birth control refill. I also need like some tampons and other things, so I'll take a walk to Dwayne Reed. Why not? It's a beautiful day. I have been watching Sal's lacrosse game. If you don't know, uh, my brother plays lacrosse in college. He scored. It was so sweet to watch. I'm emotional. Also, I need to put on a shirt because I'm going to go to the gym afterwards. I might just wear a sweatshirt, honestly. These are my favorite leggings just right now in general. They're the Lululemon Alliance, but this green color is so pretty and they're really, really soft. So basically, like from what I've learned, the Alliance, if they're like a lighter color, they are double lined because you don't want to like you know, they have to be like squat proof and stuff, but these are only one layer, but they're still this green color and I just think they're so cute. Quick mini review, cause you have to go to my TikTok or my reels to see the real one. Dunkin' Cold Foam. It came out today, so I had to get it. Not it, you know? Starbucks is better, they make it fresh. Starbucks is cool because you could add or subtract whatever you want to it, because they are making it and they put it in a blender. This one, apparently it's from a can that you could buy at the grocery store, no shade. I think that it's cool that they're offering new things, but even the taste, it was a little too sweet. The foam wasn't my fave. It like melted into the drink kind of weird. I got the chocolate flavored one, which maybe that was my mistake, because it's really sweet, but not my fave. But I'm glad I tried it. And I like that um, now Dunkin' has these cups though. These are my favorite cups, the ones that you could just like sip out of. So that's that. Let's go work out. Am I sweaty? Yes. I hate fluorescent lights. Like, oh no, that's not it. Because like me, I actually, in the gym, you guys, I was in there alone for the first like 25 minutes and I left the lights off. And then it got like to a point that it was almost too dark, but like I'm watching something on the screen. I'm just walking. I don't need this like fluorescent light. Like I'd rather just do it in darkness. I don't know if anybody else could relate or if that's like really strange. Let's make dinner. We're making HelloFresh. I am so excited. You guys know HelloFresh. Meal kit delivery service gets delivered to your door. I'll show you guys a clip right here of what the box looked like. Took out my recipes. I'm personally doing the vegetarian box this time for two people. But the cool thing about HelloFresh is that there's so many dang options. I know that they have low 
low-cal, carb-smart, vegetarian, pescatarian, plus every recipe is jam-packed with awesome produce that's from local farmers, which we love. I'm always, for some reason, in a rush. It just always seems, and I don't want to spend like an hour in the kitchen cooking, and they have like 10 to 20 minute meals. This one is going to take me 35 minutes, but the prep's only 10 minutes. We're going to like this one. They have pre-proportioned ingredients, which come in the little bag, which just means there's less food prep for you and less food waste overall. If you have a larger family too, like when I go home and I'm on Long Island, I do the family plan and feeding the whole family has truly never been easier because they do have like those larger box sizes and stuff, which is nice. You can accommodate like any size group of people. HelloFresh actually donated over 4 million meals to charity in 2020 and they're continuing to step up their food donations amid the coronavirus crisis. Let's take a look, see, what are we making? Well, I'll show you guys the ones that I got. Like I said, vegetarian box, black bean soup, sweet potato and mushroom bowls, salsa verde enchiladas. You know, I don't think I've ever made enchiladas, so this will be really stepping out of my comfort zone, but I think we can do it. We're gonna do it together. We got beans, we got flour tortillas. So let's get to it. Usually in the background, I listen to a podcast or I call a friend or something. It's really therapeutic to me. I kind of like cooking alone. I'm going to attempt, keyword attempt, to do these enchiladas because I made the stuffing. This is going to be interesting. Spread tortillas with beans. Place a small amount of filling on one half of each tortilla. Roll them up. Starting with the filled sides, and then I think we put them like upside down. And then we are going to top it with some salsa and some cheese and throw it in the oven. A little bit of this black bean mixture. Don't worry, my hands are clean and I'm the only one eating these, guys. It's not even mixture, it's just black beans, literally. I don't know how much to use. And then the filling. My baking dish isn't gonna be the right one, so we're just gonna have to live with it, but I think that's right. I think I can make them a little bit bigger than that, but I was just going low on that one, okay? Cool. Beans, beans, the magical fruit. I'm literally losing my mind, you guys. It's okay. Not actually, but maybe a little. Someone's gonna comment and be like, you are not doing this right. You know what? It's right for me. Salsa. Spoon it up salsa over to generously coat. Okay. I'm hoping I'm doing this right, you know? You live and you learn. If I am doing it wrong, I feel like this seems correct. When I go to restaurants, I don't really order enchiladas, quesadilla more so, but I feel like they're all in the same realm. Like I feel like if you like it, like if I like tacos, you like this, right? Sprinkle with cheese, bake on top rack until salsa is bubbly and cheese melts. Reach every last drop into the oven, she goes, how long? Three to five, and then finished product, Chef Brooke. So go to HelloFresh.com and use my code Michio12 to get 12 free meals, including free shipping. Once again, HelloFresh.com and use my code Michio12 to get 12 free meals. The link is down below, you guys. I can't wait to eat right now, man. This looks so good. I'm pretty proud of myself. And then I'm going to put some crema on top. Ah, so good. Wow. Let's go eat. And you guessed it. After my nice dinner I cooked, now it's time to do a bath. These are from Green Candles. They were our business of the week for Gals on the Go. Definitely check them out, they're really good. I use the Dr. Teals, that's what gets it all foamy. So many people ask how I get my bath so bubbly. I use a lot, like honestly, that's what it is. And I run it under the water, like so I don't actually, you know, as the water's running, I just run it under with it. And I use this Dr. Teal stuff. I've tried a bunch of the scents. It's really inexpensive and I really like it. And I watch my show. A lot of you guys want me to get a project for my bath who knows but for now this is a good setup good morning guys i am feeling really good today i just woke up in a really good mood we are gonna have a really good day i'm wearing my align tank top that we know it's a little small apparently they're coming out with one that fits like larger boobs so that will be exciting and then i'm wearing my boundless loungewear sweatpants and i have the sweatshirt i have this guy coming to clean my apartment at 11 so i'm gonna go to probably like a coffee shop or somewhere and just sit given that i can find one in the meanwhile i'm just like getting stuff together picking things up i need to wash my face you guys my skin is clearing up too it's so exciting i went off that horm like the pill that i was taking so i've really just been doing like my skincare and like doing all that stuff and it's working so i think it just took a little bit of time to like get into place i quickly wanted to show you guys i got this exciting package from cvs they always hook it up with their pr and this is like the best of the best from their brands so excited i'm gonna stock up my like medicine cabinet i mean i always need melatonin gummies you guys know i love like these like vix or vix knockoffs whatever like shower tabs that's exciting and i always need nail stuff i'm actually gonna go tomorrow and get my nails done you can probably tell like they're really overdue i'm gonna go somewhere new so i'll bring you guys along tomorrow but i also have been waiting on some packages to come i have to like shoot some content for some brands but the stuff hasn't come yet but i think it's coming today so they also wrote on the handy app which i can link down below uh you guys can get a discount code too i think it's available like the cool thing about it is that it's available in a bunch of different cities and stuff and it's just nice because it's like i literally just like booked it through the app 
app like this guy's like coming to clean and he messaged me and confirmed it's a bunch of like different people it's like uber you know like they find someone for you to do whatever service you're looking for i paid extra for a deep clean and it said that it was going to take five hours it said 11 to 4 it's impossible like my apartment simply isn't that big there's like two big rooms i guess there's like a bathroom too even if he deep deep cleans everything i can't see it taking any more than three hours just because the space isn't big enough like I, it's not we'll be tbd on that I got a almond milk cappuccino and a croissant and I'm just sitting here at my computer. It's so nice. Like the door is open. It feels just like nice to get out of the apartment, you know? My outfit's so random, you guys. The guy that came to clean, he was like, your apartment's already so clean. Like, what do you need clean? I was like, I wanted like, a, you know, a deep clean, like my tub, like my, I don't know, like my oven and stuff. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I didn't even realize it was that clean. Like, I feel like, you know, it needed a little more. We'll see. Back home, it looks like I'm naked because I'm wearing this strapless shirt. I haven't worn a strapless shirt in the longest time, but it feels good because it's like a light breeze in the air. I'm wearing, um, sweatpants but i just got a bunch of stuff in the mail that i have to unpack but he did a fantastic job but it's like through handy so i'll leave my link down below i personally put it in for the deep clean setting but he walked in and was like i kind of tried to explain this to you guys he was like your place is already clean he said that i have one of the cleanest in new york i don't want to brag but that was a flex because i'm not known as being like the most tidy person at least with my family and stuff but i feel like since i have my own apartment like i just value the space so much that like i like it to be tidy so that was cool anyways he was really nice i'll leave my handy link down below i think you guys get like 50 dollars off i get 50 dollars off pretty good i do need to work out unbox all these packages i think i said i wanted to take like a photo or something but it's so much earlier than i, I anticipated because he finished so much faster but the floors look so clean it looks really good victoria's secret pink you guys are doing swim again i remember for a little bit i think that they stopped well, I know Victoria's Secret did because I used to get all my bathing suits from there and then I remember they were like not doing it anymore I am so excited to try these on. I picked out a few. I really like this yellow one I don't know how the sizing is gonna run on these. Oh, I like this blue one I'm just a fan of like symbols like no patterns, but then I have to look for specific cuts. Oh, this is one piece Oh, i'm definitely gonna try these on in a little bit <laughs> Maybe after I work out just so the confidence is high and then they also sent me like a beach towel What else is in here? Oh my god, they hook it up for me. Seriously so much good stuff in here Wow, we got slides. We got all sorts of scents. They sent this to me and I thought that the box was really cute. Thanks, Pink. Just took a nice steamy shower. These under eye patches are from Tarte. I can link them down below. They're these ones. They sent me them and I don't really do face masks because my skin is like really sensitive right now, but I'll do like under eye masks and like facial, like I'll use like the roll ice roller and stuff. These are them. Pretty cool. And then I'm wearing this set from Everlane that I just got. I ordered cob for dinner because, because. <laughs> so beautiful to me. Greens and grains bowl. And I treated myself and I got pita chips on the side. I would say like half the time I get pita chips on the side. It's so good because the dips are on top. I love it. This is literally just, oh my God. All right, good morning, good morning. I'm gonna switch to my other camera because I'm gonna go get my nails done. Very excited. Last night, I ate my dinner. I FaceTimed some friends. Oh my gosh, makeup is not blended. Thank you camera for showing me that. I've been just doing concealer and like a little bit of powder. So sometimes it it's like, you know, in like weird patchiness on my face, but it's just because I'm trying to go for a lighter look these days. Anyways, I'm going to paint box nails. Crazy expensive. Like, we'll see if it's worth it. <laughs> I'm going to get some kind of nail art. I don't really know what, some sort of something. So stay tuned. I'm also going, I believe, to get laser hair removal today for the first time. Um, I've never done that. And I've always been curious, especially under my arms. Even when I shave, like I have like a dark shadow. I'm not like too hairy of a person all over. Like, yeah, it would be cool to like get on my legs, my arms and stuff, but definitely under my arms. Also like bikini area. I've heard that's really popular. It's just gonna be a crazy day. Let's go get our nails done. Enjoy the day. I got like two new pairs of Align leggings because I've been working out a lot. And yeah, these are the just, I think they're just the regular or they might be the ultra high rise. I'll confirm and I'll link below. I wear a size six in the Aligns. I love them. They're just so comfortable. They literally fit like a second skin. I'm wearing my uh, Ultra Boost sneakers, this Everlane pullover, which I will also link down below. And then I'm gonna put on my Aritzia jacket because it's gonna be kind of cold today, so. Taking off, I'm gonna do a variation of this guy right here with orange. So hopefully it doesn't look terrible. I love them, so fun. They're good, right? I can't stop listening to old Beyonce right now. Um, specifically this album. I guess it is the Dangerously in Love album. I didn't know, but this is my nails. Oh my gosh, this is just one of the patterns. I feel like at any nail salon where they could do, you know, patterns, they could probably do this. She painted the nail pink first, and then she went in with like a brush and did the orange. Definitely bold. I feel like it like goes with my skin tone and stuff. Like the orange goes. I personally like it. I'm really happy with it. You guys know me in nail art. I just like the shape of my nails. She did them more of like an oval shape. I know they're really short, but 
I like keeping them short. So I have a little bit of time and then I'm going to go get laser hair removal. I'm just doing everything recently. Self-care to the max. I'm gonna get it on my armpit area, I think. I'll take you guys along, but I'm going to this place called Romeo and Juliet Salon, but it's in Midtown and I'm really excited about that, so cool. I'm gonna go work out and then I'm gonna come back and really do like a full self-care mode thing. Just have a lot of like products and treatments and stuff like that that I wanna do. I mean, I did those eye masks yesterday, which I feel like they actually kind of did help, but I wanna do a bath. I mean, I do a bath all the time, so it's not really just that, but I have some other stuff too. I'm almost done with All American. I'm on season two. It's, well, season three's out. It gets pretty sad, just like it's heavy, heavy topics. So I've been slowing down, but I still am watching that. I bring my iPad down and we'll just do that. By the way, this sports bra underneath that I've been wearing today is from Amazon. I think it's linked on my Amazon shop. If not, I will make sure to update because I really like it. I've shown it, I think, to you guys before. It's like black ribbed. It's cute. Actually, just kidding, guys. I'm gonna end off the vlog here. Sorry, I'm not gonna show you the self-care stuff because I'm gonna save that for another vlog and do like a whole like routine and whatnot. Even though I feel like this week my life was kind of wimpy, so I do apologize for that. I'm gonna get back after it, I swear. And I might be breaking them up into smaller videos again just because, I don't know, I feel like I don't have enough like content for the week of my life right now. Like life is just kind of boring. I got this new pullover from Little Lemon though. Isn't it cute? And I'm wearing some yoga pants. I have a lot of like laundry and stuff to do. I'll talk to you guys all another time. Love you so much. Bye.